Angel Cabrera is one of the real bombers in professional golf. And we asked his teacher, Charlie Epps, where does he get that power from? We ran Cabrera's driver sequence in the magazine, and Epps walked us through some of those power moves. Things like stability in the lower body and a full release of the club through the ball. But Epps says there's another power move that really makes a difference for Cabrera, and he calls it the cross lateral shift. From this down the line view, you can see Cabrera takes it to the top, his shoulders are fully turned, his, sh his hips are fully turned, and from there, his first move back to the left is a lateral shift in the direction that his hips are pointing, out to right field. Now what makes this different? A lot of teachers and players talk about that first move down to be a direct bump toward the target, right toward the target like that, which is way to the left of where Cabrera is moving. Now the difference there is if you're thick up top like Cabrera is or if you lack that flexibility between your upper and lower body, what happens is if you bump directly toward the target, your hips can start to spin open, then your shoulders start to spin open, it throws the club to the outside and you hit a lot of pulls and slices to the right. So Cabrera's cross lateral shift takes it to the top, shifts in the direction that his hips are pointing, which keeps his hips turned, keeps his shoulders turned, allows the club to drop to the inside into a powerful hitting position. So if this sounds like you, you're thick up top, maybe you lack that flexibility, give this move a try and it might be your key to bombing it off the tee.